We are coming on the air with shocking allegations out of Murfreesboro tonight. A Tennessee pastor arrested on a slew of charges, including five counts of raping a child. You're watching News Channel 5 at 10. I'm Hunter Hilglint. Pastor Benjamin Garlic as a guest pastor has spoken at several different churches in Tennessee and in other states. The question everyone now wants to know is how did this all happen? We asked News Channel 5's Jason Lamb to find out. Mug shots of Benjamin Garlic and his wife Chantal paint a picture of the traveling pastor far different than his presence online. Este libro de, este mensaje del... YouTube videos show Garlic often preaching to the Hispanic community in Tennessee and other states. On this GoFundMe page, he asks churches for $40,000 for a Garlic family ministry van to help him travel from place to place. But court records show Garlic was arrested this month after being indicted by a grand jury on five counts of aggravated rape of a child and five counts of aggravated sexual battery of someone under 13, among other charges, spanning from February 2021 to just last month. Garlic's wife Chantal was also indicted for facilitation of aggravated rape of a child and aggravated child abuse of someone less than nine years old. Chantal has bonded out. So we just got a copy of the indictment from the Rutherford County Courthouse. It does give a little more detail about what happened and when, but now we want to see if Mr. Garlic has anything to say about this. Listen closely right here. This is Jason Lamb with News Channel 5. We're looking for Benjamin Garlic. The person inside doesn't come to the door. It seems no one inside wants to talk to us. So I don't know if you could see or hear, but someone was at home and did respond when I knocked on the door. But when I told them who I was and who we wanted to talk to, they shut the blinds on the window next to me and on the window upstairs. The indictments don't say what child was abused or if there was more than one. Murfreesboro police say the investigation into the garlic case remains active and ongoing, so they can't say much more right now without any other answers coming Thursday from garlic's home. We'd just like to talk to Benjamin Garlic. We have some questions for him. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5. Jason, thank you. And court records show garlic will be arraigned on those charges next Tuesday. We will keep you updated on all of it right here on News Channel 5.